Pick my favorites. Pick what you want. Get to know each other through picks. What's your pick? Welcome back. <laughs> what? What was that? <laughs> Maddox, Maddox, Maddox. Hello. Welcome back. How was your week? Um, my week was interesting. Uh-huh. Um, I, 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 I watched a ton of Tetris champion world world championships. Tetris? Yes, Tetris. Is that like your new hobby? Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh I was just going to say. <laughs> really? Um, yeah. Tetris. You remember the Tetris that they was so famous in Korea from the website Net Mar? Yes, thing? yes. You remember that? Yes, I do. We, we, we like use the items. space bar. The items. Oh, yeah. It was amazing. That was so fun. Yeah, I remember because my sister used to play that. Uh-huh. And she got so frustrated. I was like... She banged on the table <laughs> once. <laughs> the shotgun, boom. Well, you can boom. do play by playing games, guys. Yeah. Yeah. But anyways, okay. So you're watching Tetris. Tetris. World Championships. Right. I'm okay. playing Tetris as well. Okay. Um, yeah. There's like nothing much to say. <laughs> um, Joy's doing great. Oh. And I'm doing great as well. Yeah, of course, Hooray. of course. Our k y u n g m u n i is doing great here. So, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I, don't know, I don't know why, but I want to call uh-huh. your Korean name today. Is it is it is it better for you, or just I don't know? It's one type it, thing. I don't know. It sounds it sounds more uh, warm and familiar. Oh, okay, like k u s u h a n i k i Yeah, because Ke- Maddox is like. Yeah, I'm Maddox. Like, <laughs> yeah, but like k y u n g m u n is like k y u n g m u n i Okay, you know what I mean. Right? <laughs> okay, I'll be I'll be k y u n g m u n i for for today. Yeah. Um, okay, but anyways, today is the first day of April in Korea. Oh yeah. Maddox, are you sad? March is already over. Um. Or are you really happy? Well, I'm I'm sad and happy at the same time. Okay. Because, so um, I'm sad because my birthday is over. All right, and right. I'm happy because it's gonna get warm. All right, right. Yes. Right. Getting warmer here in Korea, guys, every single day. But you, uh, you have to be really careful with the colds. All right. I it's... actually caught a cold. Oh really? Like a week ago, but it was not like a big thing. I uh-huh. got it over like like what two days. Uh huh. But I was getting chilly, oh, even though okay. it was like really warm. Okay. So yeah. So you, I I think you were, you might you might have like um got worried because like the corona virus. Right, right. I was worried, but it was not it was nothing like that. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. That's that's a tying relief. Yeah. Yes. yes, good news. I know. So, but anyways, in Korea, April is the month in which spring really does kick off. We have the cherry blossoms. We have the nice weather, the spring breeze, right. the sun, mm-hmm. the flowers, the people outside. Not right. as much as before, but yes. Mm-hmm. We even had the music festivals, but mm-hmm. not anymore. But anyways, uh, is there really something that you want to start starting of April? April? Yeah. Um, wow. Uh, I really want to like answer this question in a really interesting way, but I do not have any ideas. Okay, that's fine. So, let's say I might. Oh, okay, okay. I got one. I got one. Okay, what is it? I really want to like start my um, you know, the workout thing, <gasps> like the exercise, not right, workout, like right, exercise. Right, right. You know, right, stay healthy for right, the rest right. of the year. And since it's getting hot, um. Uh, we have to like you know the cold as well. Yeah, we have to maintain our good health conditions. Right, and stuff. right, so, right. Yeah, right. good. Good. Yeah, I actually have been working out these days, uh, trying to give it a better shape because of other stuff. But anyways, yeah. Oh, that's nice. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Gyms are still open, guys. Really being careful with all the corona, but still the yeah. COVID nineteen. Uh, but we are actually. I think the gyms are only open until like 10 p.m. All I right. So, yeah. Okay. With uh, yeah. It's it's. It's really hard to like keep the mask on and know, work out at the same I know, time. I yeah, know. I feel I you. Don't like that. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, I've also actually seen a lot of photos of Joy these days on oh. your social media. Okay. Even on your like stories, right? Right, right. So, mm-hmm. um, what? How is Joy? I mean, how do you think she's like a? It's a she, right? Yeah. yeah okay. Yeah. Do you think she's very like a smart dog or? Uh, What do you she, think? She she her personality is first. She's really scared of like um big big noise and you know, uh, she's really scared. So cute. Um, she has this um, tege sosiman, you know, very timid. Yes, and um, but but she's really she's a happy dog. She she likes to run around. Mm. She gets really excited a lot. Okay. Um, loves to eat, and 
Yeah. Everyone thinks she's like a baby. Oh, really? But she's like two, two years old, maybe. Really? Two to three years really? old. Yeah. So it's really interesting. Oh, that's yeah. maybe because she's really small. Oh, well, she, she's like, she's like, uh, this, this big. No, that's, that's small. Oh, it's big. Oh, wait, small. Yeah. Unless you're having like a teacup dog, but you're not right. a teacup dog. So, right. Yeah. <laughs> that's so cute. All right. Okay, good. Very cute. Yeah. Okay. Let's start our Thursday second hour. What's your pick? Uh, first, we have our game pick. Oh, yes. Yes. So today's game is going to be 즉석 노래 부르기 that is impromptu impromptu singing <laughs> okay thank you okay so the rules of the game are very simple okay. but it'll be different to really put it off okay there are a total of 5 topics and you're to create a song for the topic in you know in, impromptu impromptu and sing it to us and our Hong PD name here in front of us will choose the winner based on her opinion of who sang better. Oh, okay, so let me first re- reveal the topics we have. Okay. First is mic. Mm-hmm. So microphone. Okay. M I C. M I C. Number two is flower. Flower. Number three is family. Family. <laughs> number four. Is- <laughs> <laughs> number four is supercar. Okay. And number uh, five is dream. Oh. So these five. Okay, okay. Okay. These are really interesting um, topics. Yeah. I know. Uh, shall we go and straight to making the songs? Yeah. Okay. Okay. First topic is Mike. Mike. What kind of songs do you think of when you have Mike? Um. Uh. Um. Mm-hmm. Gonna grab this mic and sing it to you. Baby, baby, I love you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, um, I was actually going to go for a sadder song because I don't know what. It just feels like when I have a microphone uh-huh. and I'm up on stage, uh-huh. it, it feels really lonely sometimes. Oh, right, right. You, you have like I mean? this light on your face yeah, and you yeah, can't yeah, see yeah, anything. Yeah. yeah. So I was thinking of a melody like... My mic, I have it on here alone in the stage. But you know that this song is for you. Yeah, I don't know. Oh, like that. that's yeah. nice. That's nice. I don't know. That's nice. Yeah. <laughs> okay, that was a sad song from Horn. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, number two. Number flower. two. Flower. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Um, okay. Okay. Um uh oh this is this is really like getting I'm getting nervous right now. <laughs> yeah. Oh this is hard. Okay. Um so I'm going to choose the sunflower. Okay. Um sunflower I want to be with you like the sunflower. <laughs> oh, I like, like that. Like the sun is yeah, shining yeah. for sunflower. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, I like that. <laughs> no, no, no. I was, good. I was like making up the words yeah, and the yeah, lines yeah, yeah, at yeah. the same time. I was like, bum, 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 no, bum. I like that. I like that. It sounds Thank good. You. Um, Thank you. Flowers. I'm going to go with more of a little uh, bit like a childish song. Okay. A flower is here for you all the time. A flower is here for you to smile at me and you and you and you. <laughs> oh, know. yes. I, 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 I really like the you and you and you and stuff. <laughs> yes. <laughs> that was nice. Okay. Number three, family. Family. Yes. Okay. Um, okay. Family. I really want to stay with you, family. Oh, oh no, no. Family. Oh. I really want to live with you, family. Oh. Oh, yeah. I would, did not expect that topic or that theme. <laughs> Yeah, I don't know where it came from. Really? <laughs> yeah, it's okay, interesting. Okay, okay. Uh, <laughs> since we don't have that much time, we're gonna do this one, the last one, the, the family one. Okay, um, okay. What? How, how would I use family? <laughs> I don't know. Maybe we could go with like an ASMR kind of song. Oh, that's nice. That's like, nice. My sister and I both live in Korea. My dad and mom. Are in Peru, but I miss them so much, so much, so much, so much. <laughs> oh, that really—you know—the start. 
It sounds like Billie Eilish. I tried to make it like Billie Eilish. <laughs> so I was like, oh, this is yeah. good. <laughs> I'm really uh, bad at, me- you know, writing melodies. So. No, it was great. It was great. It's a hard thing to do. I know, you know? I know. We exactly. have to like make up the words and the yeah. lyrics. You know, you know what I'm saying. Right? Yeah. But okay, so our p d n i m is going to choose who is going to be the winner. So. Oh. <laughs> Okay. Really? Oh, 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 I see, I see, I see. I see. Okay. So, congratulations to Hoan. Oh, yeah. Uh, she actually chose me because I had like a variety of like melodies. Yes, and, and you know, themes. the styles. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That was great. Uh, yeah. <laughs> so, okay. what is the punishment? <gasps> Today's punishment is going to be singing a song dedicated to the winner. Oh. So, I'm ready. Um, Show me your love. Show me how, how much you care oh, about Oh, wait, me. wait, wait. I want to... Uh, do, you know, do you know the song Congratulations by... Day 6? Um, no. Oh. Um, uh, um, Congratulations. <laughs> Post Malone <laughs> and <laughs> Justin Bieber. I, I don't know. Uh, you, can, you can sing for us. Wait, I want to I ch- like, find the lyrics. Okay, okay. Is we it, can talk okay? about something else as you find the lyrics. Okay, okay. So, but anyways, guys, uh, we are actually here on your game picks. Maddox oh. is finding uh, the lyrics for the song. Congratulations, bye. Okay, Justin so it, it wasn't, it wasn't, it wasn't Justin Bieber. It was Quavo. Oh, okay, okay, okay. okay. Oh, my mama calls. See you on TV. Since... Okay, this isn't appropriate. Congratulations, <laughs> congratulations, congratulations, nations, nations, h o w a n s e e Congratulations. <laughs> <laughs> okay, the second word had some um, had some swearing, so I was like, "Oh no!" <laughs> okay, congratulations. It's so, no, it's so funny how you changed right away to congratulations. <laughs> okay. Congratulations. Okay, okay. Calm down. All oh. right. Good. Thank you so much for that song. I liked it. <laughs> yeah, h o a n s h i I like that part as well. <laughs> Okay, uh, so we're gonna move on, guys. We have to listen to a song before we come back with more. The song is "Storyline" by s o k y o t o n g i p a m featuring Tawan. Now, starting our "What's Your Pick" segment. First of all, Maddox is going to tell all of our happy listeners how to participate. Okay, send us your stories about your favorite psychology test, preference test, and this or that test, and things that are hard to decide. Please make sure to write "What's Your Pick" on top of your story and send it to the send message board of Hot Beats. In website, yes. Oh, it's right. It's so, right. Um, yeah. www. arirangradio slash hotbeat. You can also DM Hotbeat's Instagram hotbeat 0409 or use the Arirang Radio application on your app stores. <laughs> And you can rewatch What's Your Pick segment with Maddox. You can see them on our Hotbeat's website VOD page or by searching a r i r a n g Radio on the YT channel. So check it out and please watch a lot. Okay? Oh yes. Now. Let's see the first story for what's your pick we have. Okay, our first story is from Athir. Yes. From um, Saudi Arabia. Yes. Arabia. 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 Hi, Hody and Maddie. This is Arab Chingu. m a r h a b a Okay. <laughs> How have you been? I hope you're having great day so far. I'm here today to talk about spring summer season. Mm. Is it spring yet in Korea? It is. And how is it? Good. Here in Saudi <laughs> and the and the Middle East countries, we have very hot weather. Mm-hmm. Spring is only once uh once a month. That is March, and then the temperature goes up like crazy. Right. As we at the end of March, it's 39 degrees Celsius, maybe, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. already. In the summer, it usually reaches 45 <gasps> or more, What? and I just want to run away now. Oh my gosh. So I want to ask you, would you choose summer and spring or fall and winter forever? And why? Mm. For me, it's the second one, and the reason is so obvious. Thank you, Hody and Maddox. Have a great day. Heart to heart. So, Athir, thank you so much for that message, first of all. Right. And yeah, talking about the summer and spring or fall or winter, what do you think is better? Oh, wow. I would love summer and spring. Mm. Yes. Really? Like 39 degrees to 45? Uh, Are you okay with that? That is, that's, I think that's too much. <laughs> But 
<laughs> but when when I when I went to LA, um, uh-huh. it was great. It was great. I had the sun on me, um, oh, right, every right, single right. time. Right, right, when right. I when I like go outside, right, the sun is like waiting for me. I can right, like work right. out in the streets. It was so it was amazing. Right. So I, I yeah, I would love that. So it depends on where you are, right? Um, uh, maybe. Right. <laughs> maybe. <laughs> but I I would prefer summer and spring better. Yeah, more uh, like yeah, I prefer. Yeah, cuz summer and spring in Peru as well, it's like 20 degrees to 30. That's it. Mm. And for fall and winter it's from like 15 to 20 20 ish, 22 to 20, 23. Th- that's that's actually good weather. It's very warm. Wow. Yeah. So if I was actually in South America, I would actually choose um fall and winter mm-hmm. because in winter time we also have like sun so it's fine. Uh-huh. I would rather have coldness than being hot. Oh. But still, I would miss the sun. Right. Yeah. There's something about spring that's really beautiful. Mm-hmm. It that, is actually, that's yeah. sunny and like, you know. Yeah. But I don't like summer here in Korea or neither in South Korea, Saudi Arabia. <laughs> I would not handle it very well with 45 degrees. Me neither. Yeah. No, never. Exactly, right? <laughs> Oh my gosh. So, Thea, good luck with the summer and the spring. Good yes. luck with you. Moving on to our next message, we have Hilma from Sweden saying, cats or dogs? And what's the reason behind your pick? Nice. Oh, okay. <clears throat> well, thank you, Hilma. Cats or dogs? Cats or dogs? I go with cats. Oh, the reason is? Because I have a cat right now that I cannot, like, it's, uh-huh. I mean, I used to love dogs more. Uh-huh. But now that I actually raised a cat, uh-huh. <laughs> it's just... It's just so cute. Yeah. Uh, dogs are smart and they're like all cute too. Right. But cats are just... They, I don't know how to explain it. They're <laughs> they, just really cute. They have their like, um, you know, the uh, they, their own charm. Yeah. They have their own like little space. Their yes. own aura. And it's right. like, <gasps> so right. cute. That's true. Yeah. I think they, they both have pros and cons. Mm-hmm. Well, it's really hard to say cons. <laughs> But, you know, cats have, um, they like to play a lot, but they don't have to go outside. I think that's a, mm. um, a good thing for these, you know, the... the COVID-19 the, era. Yeah, COVID-19 and the busy people. Who right, are, right. Are like, instantly, like, constantly moving. working and, uh-huh, you know, uh-huh. moving. So, right. I think that's a good thing for um, people who are busy. Mm-hmm. But for dogs, um, they're really, like, cuddly. They, they like to... Mm. Um, I, I feel like they're... My 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 friend, right? They're closer right, to right. like a friend. No, I know what you mean. Yeah, but um, I think the challenging part is you have to always um, take them out for a walk. Right, right, Cause, right. Because like all they do, all they can do is walk. So they're more of a big responsibility. Yes, yes, mm-hmm. that was a word. Mm-hmm. That was great. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So, but I. I still choose dogs. It's because dogs are more dependent and cats are more independent. Right. But there are some cats, I mean, like, for example, Kum. But, yeah, I'm not going to say this. Because they always (laughs) say that they are more independent versus dogs. But cats Mm. also get lonely. Oh, right, right, yeah. Yeah. That's a famous thing, yeah. Yeah, they always get lonely. Mm. It's it's very interesting to see cats. Mm. That's why they're so cute. Yeah, they're like, yeah. They pretend not to be lonely. (laughs) But they always, like... Show you so much love. <laughs> right. Very chic. They're very chic. Uh huh. But they're so like, yeah. I don't know. I don't, yeah. I, I know what you're saying. I know, like, yeah, they, right? they sometimes come up to you and then they just like, um. Like, like yeah, they yeah, degrees. They're they they, they go like this. They're like, oh, so cute. It's, yeah, they're so yeah. cute. Yeah. Chimyong <laughs> It's very like, yeah, deathly charm there. Right. Okay, next <laughs> message, please. Is from As Isabella from France. Mm hmm. Hello, Hody and Maddox. I have to move. Uh, I I have to move houses this year. Yes. So I've been having a lot of thoughts about houses these days. Okay. I wonder what you consider to be an ideal home. Oh. Okay. So it's uh this or that question. So we should pick, right? Yes. Okay. Okay. The first question is cozy house that you can comfortably rest in, uh-huh. or a house that you can do your favorite activities all you want. Oh, that's hard. I I feel so good already. You do. Yeah. Okay. I have mine. One, two, two three. three. The second one. one. Oh. Okay. Yo, you can do anything. I know. That's what I was gonna say. Cause you can do everything you want. Yeah. Inside the house. I would have like this. This you know the filming studio and the oh. the, the music production yeah, studio yeah, yeah. and I stuff. Yeah, yeah, I know what you mean. I know what you mean. <laughs> 
But I'm also a person who thinks that houses are for resting. Right, that so, is true. Yeah, that is I was true. confused about mm, that. That was yeah, that's important. Okay, okay, okay. The second one, house with a lot of sunlight or quiet house. So that means like a co- cozy, dark kind of kind a dark of yeah. theme mm-hmm, house. Mm-hmm. Mm. One, two, two three, three, one. one. I need sunlight. We need sunlight. Yeah. Okay, the next one, house in the city or house in the countryside. Oh, oh, this is challenging. One, two, two three, three city. countryside. Oh, okay. I'm gonna stay with city. <laughs> if if I if I have like all these options, I would definitely go to the countryside. Oh, really? Yeah. Okay. Okay. <laughs> living with your family or living alone? Uh, oh, this is hard. Like, actually, really hard. Um. Uh, okay. Okay. One, one two, two, three. three one. One. Yeah, I choose one. I mean, I used to like to live alone, but mm-hmm. now that I live with my bandmates, mm-hmm. I th- I don't think I'll be able to live alone. Oh, yeah, yeah, it gets lonely. Yeah, yeah. to have someone to eat with together every single oh, time. Oh, that's so it's like it's like yeah, that's that's family, right? Yes, yeah. yes, totally. Yeah. Okay, the last question is house with a high ceiling or house with a lot of windows. Oh, okay, so high house with a high ceiling but has like two windows. <laughs> Or <laughs> house with a lot of windows, but it's like... It's uh, like right, right, yeah. right. I know what you mean. One, two, <laughs> two three, three, one. Windows. Really? Oh. I go with high ceiling. Oh, really? Yeah. But you don't have the sunlight. But, I mean, I mean, sure. But... Uh, it's it's, it's a I silly ha- question, but though. I, I but, mean, but I had to, if I had to choose between, uh, like, windows and uh-huh. having a high ceiling, uh-huh. I'd rather have a high ceiling. Okay. High ceilings gives you that... Like openness, right? That's true. That is Windows true. is like less like security, right? <laughs> <laughs> what is security? Kind of like less uh, um, privacy. Yes, that is yeah, true. Come on, that is you true. Need your privacy. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah, that was that was fun, Isabella. Thank you so much for those um this or that questions. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Uh, I think we should actually listen to a song before I come back with more, okay? Okay. The song is Colorblind by Maddox. Moving on with more of our What's Your Pick stories, this is our next story. Marie from Brazil says, Hello, Juana Maddox. How are you guys? So I have one question. Have you guys ever been through a moment in your life where something that you really wanted finally happened, but when you started to get a little anxious, even though it's something you have been waiting for or wanting for a long time, because you know that this thing is going to change a lot of your areas in your life? A lot of things are happening right now, and I'm super happy and at the same time a little anxious because everything is happening super fast, and I still have a lot of things to do. So what would you guys do in this kind of situation? Like, what would you do to relax a little and try not to freak out? I could use some advice. Thank you, guys. Love from Brazil. Please stay safe. Wow, thank you. Oh, gosh. So, yeah. Yes. That's me. This is actually me. Oh, really? Yeah. Why? Um, because I I feel like everything's moving really fast mm. for Double Twin Four as well as for me, uh-huh. but I don't have the capacity to actually receive all that oh, at the okay. same time. You yeah. know what I mean? Yeah. 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 I I do feel you. I this is this is how much I can contain, but life is giving me this much right now. Uh huh. And I'm like, okay, so I get your point. And I know what you want, uh-huh. and I I want it too, but my body and my mind and my, you know what I mean? Yeah, I yeah, res- yeah. The fact that I have restrictions makes me become anxious. Yeah, I I, I totally get it because like it happens. I think this ha- this is happening to a really a lot of people mm-hmm. these days. Mm-hmm. So yeah. Um. Uh, so <laughs> maybe you can ask us. We are going to be your, I guess, robots for right. uh, for your uh, counseling team. Right. Mm-hmm. So, Maddox, what would you give advice for Marie? Um. Okay. So I will give you a simple answer. Um, because I'm a robot, <coughs> just try to stay happy and thankful for everything that is happening to you because um, everything happens for a reason <laughs> and 
Robots don't laugh. They don't laugh. <laughs> I was coughing、um, gasoline. <laughs> so yes, please stay happy. You know, just just try to stay positive. Positive is key, and、um, stay happy. Yay! I got your point. Thank you very much. Yes. Marie is going to be very happy. But anyways, <laughs> <laughs> but it's it's okay to have a little bit of anxiousness because I think that is healthy too. Yeah. Yeah. Because like fe- um just 받아들이는 거 just yeah suck, sucking everything in yeah is human. But it's true. I mean, I always tell myself that I should relax, and the next day I'm like, <laughs> I cannot do this. This is too much. That's you true. You know, it always happens. That's true. That's true. But every single day, live your day like your it day. This is your day to、yes. seize the day. So you, yeah. You don't have time to like stay lazy or you know freak out. Freak out. Yeah, man. Let's keep it on. Keep it on. Keep it going. Keep it going. <laughs> move it. Move it. Move it. <laughs> move it. Move it. This makes me more anxious. <laughs> <laughs> okay, moving on to our next story, please. Okay, our next story is from Tasin from Bangladesh. Hello, do you like porcelain or ceramic? Or ceramic.、Mm-hmm. ceramic. Porcelain or ceramic? What's por- porcelain? Porcelain is like um, tojagi. Oh. It's like. The, those are the shiny ones, the ones that are like really easily to break.、Uh-huh. Ceramic is more of, I think the way that you make it is different.、Uh-huh. Porcelain, porcelain is more like yuri. It's like more glassy,、uh-huh. and ceramic is more kind of like rough. Oh, okay, rough. Yeah, that is like not、um, easily broken. Ceramic is less breakable than. Porcelain. Porcelain、oh. is very fragile. Porcelain.、Mm-hmm. Okay, I go with porcelain. You like you like porcelain. You know how like they say like you have porcelain skin, it's very like shiny and like glassy. Oh, I wish. Oh, wish. <laughs> no, I I haven't I haven't actually heard of the word porcelain before. So, okay, okay. Yeah, it's so I would actually go with ceramic because porcelain is just it's too scary to have. Oh, but what if what if you just keep it at a a certain place and well, just they, leave well, it maybe, there? Well, maybe yeah. For、But、like、still. you know the interior design and stuff. Ceramic、yeah. looks a little bit more antique. Oh. And handmade. Oh, okay.、Yeah. Porcelain is a little bit more artificial, I guess. Oh, like the 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 kongjang, yeah. The factory. Yeah. Thing. Oh, yeah. Okay. Okay. Mm-hmm. How to? Mm-hmm.、Oh. It's different. Yeah. This is how you differentiate it between Korea、uh, in in Korea and between. Yeah. Exactly. Ah.、Oh. Yeah. 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 It's different. Okay. You know what I mean. Okay. Okay. That's interesting. Okay, moving on to our next story, we have Paulina from Finland saying, "Hello, Hoan and Maddox. What does it mean to live a good life? What does it mean to live a good life? That's a great question." Oh, living a good life. Living a good life. I was actually um thinking of、uh, happiness. Well, actually,、mm. I I I got I got a question on t- on the you know the bird, the bird SNS. Okay. Uh huh. And um someone asked me. How how to stay happy? Some it was like how to stay happy. Yeah, it was like that kind of question, right? And I think living a good life is wait is wait no it's not it's not being happy, <laughs> is it? Sure, I mean happiness would be、uh, one of the ways to live a good、mm. life. Yeah, being so, happy for everything, right? Yeah,、mm-hmm. living a good life for me is just um. Being real,、mm. um, thinking about the people around you, like not not everyone, but mm-hmm, you know、mm-hmm. the really close people around you, right, and right, right. The the things are happening right in front of you, because、mm-hmm. like、um, these days, a lot of people, including me,、mm-hmm. I like really、um, look at the SNS and pigo. You just oh、like, uh, yeah. I like、you、compare. I compare myself to other people. Right, right. Then right. I get really like frustrated or like right, anxious right. And, and sad. So, right. Um, I think living a good life for me is just to stay real. Stay real. And、mm-hmm. be happy for the things you have right now. Right, like, right, right. Sleeping in a bed is 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 a、uh, is a、uh, is a pl- pleasure. No. Yeah, it's, of course. It, yeah. It's happiness. Yes,、yeah. it is. So. What I was gonna put with that is living a good life is knowing how to be thankful for everything. Oh, yep. That's that, I think what you wanted to talk yeah, about. Yeah,、right? yeah, yeah. Good. We have the like the same flow. Flows. Thank you. 
Nice. <gasps> Moving on to our next story. Is from China from USA. I can relate to Maddox about the bad memory. I always forget what I do, and instead of recording everything like Maddox does, I write it. I write everything down in a journal, and it helps a lot. Yeah, it does. Seeing how much I grew in a month is such a good feeling, and I'm glad I started writing so I can remember. Mm-hmm. What is one memory you never want to lose? Mm. I would say mine would be when I graduated high school in. 2019 and ran into my father's arms. Oh, that's a nice image. Wow. Um, what it would be one of the oh. images, memories I don't want to erase. Hmm. Probably the day that I went <clears throat> to college. Probably right. Uh, getting on that plane with my mom, uh, leaving my dad alone uh-huh. in Peru. I remember that day. Oh, yeah. And also leaving my mom, you know, when I was in Korea, she mm-hmm. left me here alone in Korea. So, uh, going to college, yeah, wow. those memories. Wow. Yeah. So is it like a good memory? Oh, it is a good memory. Oh, yeah, okay. yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. Sad, but at the same time happy. Mm. Yeah. Okay. So for me, I would actually, um, if someone asked me on like, you know, the mess for as a message. I would have to go to my computer and search it <laughs> because I I have a lot of footage footages. But uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. um, I think I really want to. Oh, I have one memory when I was in England. Okay. Um, I really wanted to eat some sweets. Okay. Candies and stuff. So, but I didn't have money because like I was like a kid. Right, right, right. Um, I of course. I made I made some you know the some fake. It's bad, but I made some fake. Papers oh, for donations yeah. for oh, dogs no. and oh, no. pets. Oh no! So, me and my friend, we 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 went to like every single house in the right, neighborhood, right, right, right. having like a basket right. and then <laughs> collecting money, and then we ran into our teacher. Oh no! School teacher. So then we got busted, but then, um, we 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 still got our money, so we went and bought some oh, candy and stuff. Yeah, that's that was cute. that was a good memory. <laughs> Bad kid, but nice, nice memory. Right. <laughs> okay, so now before we wrap up, I think we should go through this psychology test really, really fast. Okay. 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 So Grace, nineteen ninety four, has sent us a message telling, "Hodi hodi, dox dox, I love the night in Seoul because all of the fancy neon signs, the stars that I see on my way home at night, are so beautiful and stunning. And now it's turned into a question. So I imagine a late night walk to your house." What lights are you seeing right now, Hodi and Maddox? Please choose an answer among the following. Okay. We have four choices. Okay. Number one, shopping center. Mm-hmm. Number two, tall building. Mm-hmm. Number three, Namsan Tower. Or number four, lights in the residential area. Oh. Yeah. I want all of our hobby listeners to also actually choose. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. What do you think? You imagine yourself a late night walk to your house. Um, what kind of lights are you seeing? Shopping center, tall building, Namsan Tower, or lights in the residential area? Um, I think I have to choose tall building. Really? Yeah. I'm gonna say lights in the residential area. Okay. So okay. I choose tall building. Who wants to choose lights in the residential area? Hobby listeners, choose two. Now moving on to the results. Okay, the people who chose a uh, shopping center that is. Um, sixty-five percent. Uh huh. Chance. chance of falling in love with an unexpected individual. Interesting. Oh, so this is like a percentage. Um, uh, I think so. Yeah. Oh, test. okay. Yeah. So shopping center has sixty-five percent falling in love with an unexpected individual. Right. Number wow. two. Those of you picked the tall building, like Maddox did, your chance of dating this year is thirty percent. Apparently, it's best that you let go of your yeah. Uh, X A S A P. Oh, okay. Oh, thirty <laughs> percent is it's, it's okay. Not, it's not that bad. It's okay. Yeah, it's not that bad. <laughs> those those who picked the Namsan Tower, you your chance of dating this year is ten percent. Oh my gosh! Congratulations. <laughs> Please your, lower your expectations a bit. Even better if you completely lower it. Mm. Ouch. Okay, those of you who chose the lights in the residential area, your chance of dating before the end of the year is 80%. Ooh, wow. Apparently someone around you have good feelings towards you, so please be careful. Ouch. Okay, okay. W- 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 why careful? <laughs> I have no idea. <laughs> but wow. Maybe it's Maddox. I don't Congra- know. <laughs> 
<laughs> Congratulations, you have like Thank 80%. You. 80%? Wow. Oh gosh, dating this year, 80%. Yeah, <laughs> that's not gonna happen, guys. And seriously, <laughs> not gonna happen. Moving on, I hope um, you all got your answers, what you wanted to get, h o p p y listeners, right, too, okay? Right. Now, time to us to wrap up our segment. s um, oh, By the way, starting next week, very important announcement for all of our h o p p y listeners. Me and Maddox will be meeting every Friday from now on. Friday. Yes. TGI Friday. Yes. So please check out the announcement page for more details about this segment. And before we wrap up, we'll say goodbye with the ending song Jam and Butterfly by DPR Live featuring Crush and EAJ. So Maddox, we'll see you next Friday. Bye. Bye.